In this video, we will be studying about the measurement. See, different instruments are used to measure different quantities. Instruments are used to measure different quantities. Right now, how you should have an accurate measurement, it is very important. Now, if I say in order to measure the length, a meter scale or a normal centimeter scale uh, is required. Whereas if I say for measuring the mass of the vegetables, a weighing scale is required. But it would be, it would be very difficult to measure the circumference of a tree using the meter scale. So for that a measuring tape is required. So all the different things that you need to measure require different components through which they you can measure their length or mass or the time if you want now if you want to you know uh, calculate the accurate time or uh, you take to run approximately 100 meters so what you do you do not need a normal watch whereas you need a stop watch so in order to make a accurate measurements So only the funda is in order to make accurate measurement one should use appropriate instruments. Number one, second, one should know how to use the instrument properly. So these are uh, some of the uh, tips you should follow in order to measure any material measurement of length now your width depth thickness distance height are all measurements of length Right. So, uh, what we do, we commonly use rulers, then your meter scales and measuring tapes to measure length. So to measure the length of a line segment, that is, let's say AB, this is a line segment AB, you have to measure the length of uh, this line. The ruler, uh, the ruler is placed along the line with its zero point, with its zero point you will place here and you will see the point on which this ends. So you should uh, take very, uh, I mean like, you should do this very carefully and take precautions while measuring the length of this line segment because you might skip the uh, I mean like there are in the ruler there are uh, certain lines like this which are the lines of the measurement so you might skip one of the line so make sure you do it very correctly now measure the length of a curved line. See, if this is a curved line. How do you measure the its length? See, take a thread, a thin thread, tie a knot at one end, 
and the uh, end which you tie the knot keep it on the end of the line and then rotate the thread accordingly on the same surface of the line on the line i am doing it upwards just because to show that this is the thread that how we are doing the thread now stop here and mark now take a scale and see the length of the thread now this if let's say this is a scale now place the thread on the scale starting from point 0 the knot that you tied from there to the let's say it is still here 2 3 4 5 so 5 cm is the length of this wave or the curvy line so in this way you can find out the length of the curve lines Now do download our scholars learning app and enjoy learning experience with us